a picture came out over the weekend of how yoked Jalen Hurts oh, yeah. is this year compared to last year. As a guy like at camp, does that change anyone's perception of him when a guy's that athletic already? Like, do people, you know, because obviously fans go ape shit when they see this, but like yeah. guys on the team, are you thinking anything when a guy shows up and he looks that much different? Uh, you know, it's, it was one picture, so that you got to see, you know, a couple pictures because obviously, you know, with angles and stuff, it can be different. But that's just lets you know this guy's committed. He's been locked in the weight room. Uh, he cares about it. He's not because some guys go away and when they're away and they come back, you can look at a guy and know if he's been working or not. So we've seen a lot of Lamar Jackson videos going out with him in the weight room. It's a tough position, especially when you're a quarterback that runs around. You're going to be taking hits. You want a guy that can that can that can survive, you know, that type of beating in the league. So um, he we heard rumors and stories about him lifting crazy weight to Alabama and Oklahoma when he was in college. So I'm not surprised by it. But uh, once again, playing that quarterback position, there are other things that you want to see improving on uh, on the field, which I'm sure he's doing as well. But that just that's just a testament to the work he's been putting in this whole offseason. I think I saw him flying in a challenger. There's a picture of Jalen Hurts right there looking yoked. Yeah. I mean, he's big body right there. Yeah. They're going to mm-hmm. run him 400 times this year. I don't understand. <laughs> Honestly, though, at Alabama with how their program is and how Oklahoma is, I would assume this type of transformation would happen from – freshman year to senior because he was like a weight room warrior right yeah, yeah. remember he was in the gym after games on game day yep. yeah when he lost his job to Tua. so but i'm wondering listen i know he was a big squat a squat guy oh yeah huge like a big squat and i know quarterbacks the quarterbacks that i've been around they don't really like to get yoked like that you know upper body because you know you want to be limber and nimble and stuff and flexible and obviously you're throwing your arm you want to be stretched and all these different type of things but um so you don't want to be too jacked at quarterback you know you say that for the other positions but i'm sure you know him and his team maybe he's got a team like russell wilson maybe his team won out there in philly so they're above my pay grade. Pay grade. Hopefully, uh, but I like I like Hurts, man. He's I another, do too. Another quarterback. They put a lot of talent around. Getting AJ Brown, obviously Devontae. You got Miles Sanders back there. So um, you got this fast white guy from Oregon. Who knows? We'll see. Oh, very fast white guy. Please. Got a name. Austin Collie, fast white guy. Yeah. Okay. Austin Collie, fast white guy. Uh, Jordy. Collie was nice too. Yeah. Collie was fucking the guy. Were you yeah. on a team with him? No, you weren't on a team with him. No, I played against him. He was there uh, 2009, rookie year, right? Yeah. Yeah, fourth and two. Uh, he, it was about two drives where it was absolutely nothing I could do against this guy. Uh, Peyton Manning, we were locking you guys up the first half. Peyton made some adjustments. Went over there on the sideline, started drawing shit up in the dirt. <laughs> and Kali, I mean, it was literally two drives back to back where he was coming right at me in the slot. He had a visor on too, right? Yeah, he was. Yeah, he, was he had visor, of- gloves, wristband. Yeah. I mean, he had three different cleats every single week. He was, he was leading the NFL. I think his second year in uh, triple crown. I think it was yards, catches, and touchdowns. And then bad in bad hit, bad yeah. concussion over there. He uh, Patrick Chung had him uh, one year, I guess, uh, for the entirety of the Patriots game against him, and it was. I think Austin fared well. Austin did well, man. He was such a guy. Hilarious human, too. Like, you know, as much as he could be for... Sure. He's a good human. Mormon. I don't think he swore or drink ever, but Mm -hmm. great personality. Mm -hmm. Super competitive. Loved everything about him. He was a fast white guy. Yeah. Devin Allen. Hey. Faster. We got a guy. (laughs) We got a guy. You hear me? We got a guy. (laughs)